And news anchor brawl news. Oh, hell yeah. Submitted by Honey, do you have boyfriend? Honey, do you have boyfriend? Two <laughs> you said it exactly the way it's written. <laughs> Two female news anchors are in hot water after getting into a vicious bar fight after hours. So they jumped out of jacuzzi right after? I always I always feel that. Like I always see how chummy and shit and fake yeah. they are. Oh. That I'm like, fuck you guys. I know you fucking hate each other, and I'm so glad that it's finally confirmed. They always Just smile like, talk at each other. Uh, you look great right, today. You. Hey, you look fantastic, Jim. Thank you. <laughs> you having a great day? Cut. I would have to disagree oh, with what you you're saying, so but fat. Hey. back to you, Jill. Let's go to Joe with the weather. <laughs> this morning I was I was thinking about exactly that. There was this interview with who's that Jesus UK guy? He's like a he's like a long haired Jesus, UK Jesus looking dude. Rasputin. Um, he's Brand? like Richard. No, 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 no. He's he's Russell young. Brand? Russell Brand. Oh. oh. I, was, I was thinking about this Russell Brand interview with the room full of anchor peoples, and it was so ridiculous because like the contrast between those smug motherfuckers and and him. It was it was so different. So you see how fucking weird they are, because he was just relaxed and talking like a normal person, and, and, and they're so of fake. calling out their bullshit. Yeah, and then like he didn't get all uppity just because everybody else was like that. And I was like, that's dope. All right. Yeah, so I like watching him in those environments where like I, I've seen him basically where he just sexually harasses the female news anchors, and it's great. Yeah. And, they, and they love it. Yeah, yeah. He's so just like, hating on them, yeah, all that shit. Super yeah. all into it and shit. And they're like super like, oh gosh, oh boy. Like, <laughs> Have you seen Bobby Lee kiss, try to, there's like a fucking compilation of him trying to kiss all the anchors that every that's time so he's like on the. See, that's where it becomes sexual harassment because it's unwanted. <laughs> I know. Yeah. Whereas with Russell Brand, they all kind of, they all kind of liked it. Because yeah. he's he's attractive. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you see a Interesting how that works. Huh, excuse me. You're saying Bobby Lee's not attractive? Uh, I think Bobby Lee's attractive, but unfortunately, these closed-minded <laughs> women can't see uh, past nice. past the look, but the looks of the fellow. So he admits it. There we go. Not All right. I said. So this takes place in West Virginia, in Charleston. Charleston. So it's between a news anchor and a weather anchor. Oh, damn. There's hierarchies, you know that? He's a meteorologist. No! I am a meteorologist. <laughs> yeah, so uh. the news anchor, her name is Erica, and the weather anchor, her name is Chelsea. So <laughs> Erica went out for a night on the town with her husband named Donald. Yeah, so then she was out with her husband when then all of a sudden she ran into Chelsea, her coworker. Cause they're on this- God, same, I wish I could see this. I know, me too. They're on the same- Chelsea. Broadcasting too, like the same broadcast, like they're in the same team. And so- It would have been even funnier if they were like rivals and shit. Like one's from Fox and the other one's from ABC. No, they're in the shit. same crew. Yeah. They look so fake so already. this is a news anchor, this is a weather anchor. Is she, are they Latina? No one looks Asian. She kind of looks. And Breeze? They all look yeah. ambiguous. That's the whole thing. Yeah, I'm like, what? They all she look ambiguous. Looks Asian. She does look like an Asian. She does look. Like I did say look like a. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why I said that like that. You probably just saw her Asian face. She's trying to absorb <laughs> our words. That's a look I like a girl. Oh, they want to fight so bad. Oh, yeah. That looks, they're look like, at their body language. Fuck you, yeah, Erica. <laughs> they want to fight so bad. Fuck you, Chelsea. Fuck you. Was that after? <laughs> no, it was, you, it was before. <laughs> fuck you. <laughs> fuck you first. <laughs> so they did have some sort of issues with each other during work time, but then this is You read is the like news like shit. <laughs> <laughs> this is after work. They're at a bar. Chelsea approaches Donald, which is Erica's husband. Ooh. And according to Donald, Chelsea started hitting on him, but then Donald was like, I'm not interested in you, and then went back to stand next to Erica, and then he told Erica what happened. That's when Erica- oh, He's the bitch. He confronted Chelsea, or she confronted Chelsea. Oh my You better God. fucking tell me if a girl's hitting on you. Especially if it's the coworker. While you're there? Yeah, he better tell I me. I would me. love to. I, this is my dream to see her get in a fight. <laughs> you should just lie. Yeah, oh yeah, I should. No, don't lie. Say it right you now. just lie. Don't get in trouble. Yeah. Just say Tiff's. Do you want me to tell you or not? Oh, gross, don't do that. It was Tiff. Yeah, yeah, just say Tiff's, Tiff's hitting on you right now. I don't, don't want to see Jill and Tiff Julia. fight. I want to see Jill fight like someone else outside it. of our circle. I don't believe it. All right. So Ronda Rousey hit on me. <laughs> go get her, Jill. She could, she could Gio, do it. go get her. She could, she could hit that. Yeah. I respect her. I saw her hump Bart's leg. Oh, really? I'm so lucky. <laughs> She left a trail of fucking pussy juice on Ew. his calf. Oh, like in super bad with the period. <laughs> All right. So then, Chelsea. So the Erica confronts Chelsea about hitting on her husband. Yo, you hitting on my man, Chelsea? And then Chelsea shoved Erica. Ooh. No puta, I wasn't. <laughs> no puta. 
What do you expect? And then he's hitting on me. I'm fucking fine. <laughs> I told him no, and he got his feelings hurt. You're the one that's always giving them shit about accents. <laughs> but they can't do it. I can only do it. All right, fine. So then, Erica. She just looks like she sounds like that. She does. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> so then, they both fell over into the bar area, and then Erica said that her eardrum had been busted in her left ear, which caused her to bleed, and she also got a large knot on the side of her head, which turned out to be a fracture. She has a skull fracture. Oh. From what? Yeah, from what? It, it's from them getting into a brawl. Damn, she, she got some weak eardrums. She didn't fuck with you. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> weak Fuck with the wrong chest. Fuck. <laughs> yeah, so then. I wonder if she took a shoe and fucking smacked her over the head with a Chacos. stiletto. Yeah, that, yeah. Shit, that shit would probably create a little Chipote, chipote. Yeah. chipote. Chipote, yeah. Chipote. That little nub. Yeah. Chipote. Yeah, so then. Uh, I love chipotle too. The no, chipote, are awesome. chipote, chipote, chipote. chipote. Great burritos, though. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Chipotes. I knew you guys would laugh at that one. <laughs> so then Chelsea, she got a summons for a battery charge. And now Erica is in the hospital. Damn, Chelsea. Did they report on it? That would be Did dope. That's what they. Next on News at Nine, <laughs> I got our it. very own Chelsea and who's the other one? Yeah, it's like, somebody looks like somebody picked a fight with the wrong News 11 anchor. <laughs> it's like shit like that. I fucking love the uh, fakery. No, that, uh, that would have been amazing. Like, I want to see that clickbait them. Clickbait headline is right. Our very own. They never do it. They don't like to report on their own shit, which is too bad. Did anyone else, their competitors, do it? That'd be amazing. Oh, I would have. I mean, yeah, I, I know their articles written. I don't know about. The ABC. I want to see that if they report now back to you Chelsea and then she's at the hospital with a fucking <laughs> cast and a fucking Erica. neck brace yeah or Eric like, fuck you with the fucking drip yeah. <laughs> and then Chelsea goes back she's like I told that bitch <laughs> she's still in that fucking news anchor for announcing voice but yeah I'll show you guys her face oh I thought I was wish. no I wish I don't have one I'm surprised that there's no video in this day and age and there's no video so wait who hit on whose husband here the Chelsea. Latina she on the Asian girl. Her husband. Yeah. And she's the one that has a fractured skull and a broken eardrum. Even though, she, okay, so she's not the one that threw fist. She was the one that started pushing her. Yeah. So she got fucked up and she's, she's chill. Now, where's the husband's picture? I don't have one. Donald. It's funny because it's such a role reversal. Because usually, like, at the club, it's yeah. the girls that get hit on. And she and goes, the guys he was hitting on yeah. me. And then the guy's like, hey, you talking to my girl, man? You talking to my girl? <laughs> I think it's both ways. In that environment, I think it's pretty 50 50. Mm. What do you mean? How? Uh, when other girls hit on other girls' men, mm. like they get into it, and then same with the guys. I'm so oblivious though, I'd just be like, that's a friendly person. She bought me a drink. You wanna go meet her? She bought me a drink. She wants. She said I should come hang out at her apartment. What's yeah. so mean about that? <laughs> I'd be like, maybe she wants to play games with all of us. Hell yeah. Hell yeah, I love playing games. Yeah. It's like we should all hang out. And then she's like, and then you're like, okay, so I talked to her. She says just me right now. But I'm gonna talk. But we're gonna go there, and then I'm gonna set it up, and then you can come. That's so funny. <laughs> and like, and I'll download the game, and I'll have it all ready. I've had that speech, dude. I've had that speech with my friends. I love this shit. <laughs> Fucking sweet people like Joe. I don't want to invite everybody because, you know, we just met and it might be kind of weird. Mark had that happen to him. He got hit on uh, at a spa. They were both naked, two guys, or a, him and a guy. And then the guy gets out of the tub, right? And he was like, yeah. see you later, or something like that. And he like stuck his oh. ass out. And, and I didn't know he, I was getting hit on. Cause I don't, I don't really experience like too many getting hit on by dudes. Well, how did no. you remember that situation enough to tell her that? Because I've never, because I never got hit on before by a dude. You are like, that's weird. But I always hear of these gay stories that, that go down at the gym jabons. So I'm just there and I'm just by myself. And then this guy comes and he's extra friendly. And when I, I know when I go in a hot tub, if I'm there to relax, I'm just going to be there by myself. And it's like a big circle hot tub. And so he could have sat anywhere, but he sat next to me. And he starts making conversation. He's telling me about how like how hard was his flight was. Deep into your eyes? I don't know, but he was like oh. giving me a lot of extra detail. I'm like, this guy's really trying to have a conversation. He's like, oh, my flight was so hard and my neck is just, it's just so like whatever. He wanted you to rub it. I'm He's just like, like my neck. damn, that's a fucking lot of details. And then later he walked up and then when, when he came out of the water and he held the handrail and he looked back at me, that's when I was like, oh, I think this guy's gay. He was trying to tantalize me with his booty hole. Did you look at his butt? <laughs> oh, I did. I did look at it. How, how was it? Was it tantalizing? <laughs> no, it was kind of fat and wrinkly. He was like 50 years old. Oh. oh Why is wow. it that 50 year old people don't understand how they look? I don't know. Maybe it would have turned a gay guy on. Cause so me and Nikki are at the beach yesterday. 
okay? We see a guy walking, and he's gotta be 60 years old or something. He's wearing tiny little yellow shorts, and he's walking with his wife. Maybe he don't you know care. He doesn't care. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. It's about comfort yeah. at that point. Yeah. It's like he's not wearing them for me. He's wearing them for him, right? Yeah. I get it. Okay, my bad. Because, you know, when you go to like the nude beach or the people who are the most comfortable are old people. But right. it's also only yeah. old people at nude beaches. Only. Yeah, because all the young people are so self-conscious, man. <laughs>